okay. So we're simply going to call this the Bantu Not Fail. Um, if you would like to see what I did so you know what not to do, keep watching this video. Um, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. I need to figure something else out for my hair for today. This is going to be so cute. Hold me to it, y'all. Hold me to it, y'all. I will do another Bantu Knot video, but it will be better. My knots will come out looking luscious. Great. But this is what we got thus far. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all good, though. This was this was a great first try. I just want to say that this is the first time I ever tried to do a Bantu Knot in my hair. This is going to be very cute. I can see it. Can y'all see it? I can see it. All righty, guys. So let's let's just jump right in. So the first thing I'm doing is taking down my little makeshift bun I had and shaking my hair out. Um, yeah, just give it a little shake, give it a little shake. And that is rose and aloe vera water that I made. I believe it's always a great idea to moisturize your hair. Moisturize, moisturize, moisturize your hair before you do any type of style. Um, it's essential. It is essential. So, yep. Yeah. Let's spray, spray, spray. And afterwards, I'm going to grab some oil, oil, oil. And I will be oiling my scalp. Um, common misconception is that oil is a moisturizer. Please know that it is not. Oil is not a moisturizer. Oil is what you use as a sealant. What I also learned when doing this is please go ahead and... Uh, shave your nails not shave your nails but um cut your nails or trim your nails whatever you got because i had like a few little nicks on the side of my nails and my hair kept getting caught so be careful about that be careful be careful now the first thing i did wrong i went in without a plan i did not section anything and i'm not saying you have to i am not saying you have to but it would be wise to go in with some sort of a plan I didn't know what size I wanted. I didn't know where I wanted them. I was just like, let's just go for it. Let's just try it. And that was my first mistake. Again, yep. Go ahead and file your nails, guys. So I decided to just twist my hair by just rolling my hair onto each other. I didn't do a two-strand twist. And I was just like, let's just see how this goes. And what I also didn't do is I didn't secure the end of my, my locks. Which I'm not saying you have to, guys. I'm just saying that I will probably I will probably be trying that my next go around. I have one lock in the back. She doesn't know where she wants to go. She don't know if she wanna be on the left side or the right side. So she she's just gonna hang out. What you just saw me squirt in my hand with the pink top is my aloe jelly. I call it my three-in-one. I use it. I use it for retwist. I use it as a hair moisturizer and I use it as a hair food. Um, I love it. I love it. I love it. It doesn't leave flakes. It makes my hair feel good and it smells very herbal because of the stuff I put in it. I'm thinking about selling it on my website, but we'll see. I'm actually trying to get some people to. Tell me what they think before I decide to put it up there. Since my locks are kind of thick, I'm going in with two rubber bands. But as you'll see later, I'm going to have to start using hair ties because I have thick on the more thicker locks. Here we are just speeding it up a little bit just to show you more of the process of what not to do. Again, now I'm working in the middle of my hair, making sure it's moisturized with my rose and aloe vera water. And I'm grabbing um, some of my, my hair food just to condition my scalp. And I'm honestly just twisting to whichever side feels the most correct to me. Whatever feels right, that's the way I'm twisting my knots onto my head. And as you can see, yeah, they're not perfect. You see the little end pieces sticking up, sticking out. But I was just like, 
Yeah, I'll get back to it. I'll pin them down or whatever. And I think that's the one I actually used the hair tie because I'm getting to thicker portions. Alrighty, here we are at the front. Now, if you don't want to section your hair off in the beginning, you don't have to. You don't even have to do it in the middle. You don't even have to do it in the end. But I would suggest you, you get some type of a game plan going on in the front of your head. And me, at this point, I think I have a game plan, but not for real. Not for real. As you can see, I don't. I put I as you can also as you can see goodness gracious I took too many locks guys I took too many locks from the wrong section and now I have three extra locks hanging out in the back that I'm gonna have to wrap around my my uh bantu knot at the bottom look at that looking like a cinnamon roll on the side of my head it's looking crazy because she don't want to stay there's just a lot going on but as you can see, I am not giving up. I am dedicated. I am motivated. I'm still thinking I can pull something off with this. And at this point, this is when I decided that, hey, I need to secure the ends as well as the, the knot itself. Last Bantu knot, guys. Woo! Yeah, we're just going to pin that right there. Last Bantu knot. Oh, my goodness. Now these three at the end, so what I first decided to do was just wrap it around the knot, but that, mm, mm that was not okay. So if you mess up like that, just take your whole Bantu knot out and reattack. Retwist up, yeah, retwist up your locks into the knot it's supposed to go in. And here we have it guys. Oh my gosh, the final look. This did not turn out how I wanted it to turn out. But it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Because we're not gonna call this a failure. We're gonna call this a, just not a successful style. This just wasn't, this just was not a success. It wasn't a success. It was a learning experience, a learning opportunity. See, now I'm here. You can only go up now, baby. I can only go up. So if you ever find yourself discouraged about a hairstyle that doesn't come out right, don't worry because it happens to the best of us. Look at this. What is that? Makes no sense, but it's okay. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. I will do this again, and it will be better. All right, guys. Be blessed, be blessed, be blessed, and be safe. Peace.